UCF's Pro Day also. Today we're all eyes once again on linebacker Shaquem Griffin, our insider Josina Anderson with us. Jojo, Griffin making the most of his opportunities this offseason, whether it was at the Reese Senior Bowl or the NFL Scouting Combine. How do you do today? Well, Tony, Shaquem Griffin's pro day here at UCF is in the books. The former UCF linebacker and defensive back ended up being the star of the combine after running that 4-3-8-40, which was the fastest uh, for a linebacker since 2003, getting the 20 reps on the bench press. And the purpose of the pro day today, guys, was to complete unfinished business, things that he was not able to do at the uh, combine after he started cramping. So today he did the vertical, got a 36.5 on that measurement. He did the L cone drill. He told me that his fastest was 6.9. And then the other thing he wanted to do was to be able to complete linebacker and defensive back drills together uh, so he could show not only that he can rush the quarterback, but also that he has fast footwork, that he can move his hips, that he can also catch the ball in the secondary. Now, obviously, that is a, a very good feat for him. You know, he's missing his left hand, having that amniotic band syndrome, a prenatal condition that led to him amputating his hand at the age of four. So he was able to show that today in front of 31 NFL teams and real quickly Tony I wanted to also get in that last night he was able to meet with the defensive coordinator uh, with the Saints so that is good he also told me last Sunday that he met with the Titans so those are a couple of teams that he's also been talking to since the combine and he tells me now that he's planning to go uh, to Tampa to train with his twin brother uh, Shaquille who you know is the cornerback from the Seahawks to finish training from now all the way up to the draft and of course all eyes will be on him and all the other stars but in particular Shaquille Queen to see if he does get drafted, which he is in full expectation of doing after completing, as you said, the Senior Bowl, the Combine, and now his Pro Day today. We are here with Shaquem Griffin right after his Pro Day here at UCF, and I want you to tell me how you feel like it went today and the things that you were able to do today. I mean, I think it went pretty well. I mean, I, I got a good jump today in the vertical. I mean, I got a chance to do the DB drills and show them what I actually can do. Uh, I did the, the three cone, the L drill today, and they said I touched, my le I touched down with my left hand. So I had to redo it, and I ended up going faster. So that's, that's a good thing. You know, they, they tell you to do it again, and you, you go faster. You know, there's nothing wrong with that. But they did tell I touched my left hand. I mean, I thought that was kind of funny. But <laughs> other than that, I mean, overall, I, I showed them that, you know, I can backpedal. I can get the brakes good. I, had, I showed good hips today. You know, a lot of scouts said I had a, a wonderful day today, and, you know, I could take away with that. So your brother Shaquille Griffin is here, who's the cornerback from the Seahawks. I know he trained you down in Miami. So how did he say you did as far as what he was looking forward to? Oh, he's definitely taking all the credit right now. <laughs> I mean, sure. literally when the coach was giving me credit today and he'll come around, he's like, you know, I, I coached him up. You know, I definitely got him right. So, you know, he definitely taking all the credit. You know, all the credit goes to him. So he, he put a lot of time in me to make sure that I was, you know, not making mistakes and making sure that I was getting out of breaks good and, you know, taking false steps up my breaks. You know, he, he put a lot of work in with me. So that, that's, that's pretty good. All right, so you met with the Titans last Sunday, mm -hmm. and then last night you were able to meet with the defensive coordinator, the Saints. So tell us about those meetings, the starting with the Saints first. Uh, I mean, I think the meeting was overall it was good. I mean, they gave me a chance to kind of, you know, get a feel for them, you know, just hang out, you know, talk to them, and just, you know, just be normal around them. I, I didn't have to show too much. And, you know, we watched film, went over different plays, and wanted to see if I knew football. And, you know, I know a lot of football, so, you know, I, I think I, I gave myself an A on that. He said I did a pretty good job with, you know, knowing what's going on and knowing football. and being able to comprehend their plays and stuff. So, I mean, overall, that was, I think it was 100% for me. So what is next for you after this process? You got that 438, that stands at the comma. No one's taking that from you. You did your uh, DB drills today. So what do you feel like you showed and what's next? I mean, I feel like I show everything they want to know. You know, I can, I can do linebacker drills. I can do DB drills. I can move around fast. I can run fast and I can jump high. I mean, I think I think <laughs> that covers it. I think I'm done for the most part with when it comes to you know combine training or pro day training. It's time to get back in football shape and you know, get some more running in and lifting weights. Time to get drafted. Oh yeah, no All doubt right. about that.